finally back home in Korea and it feels so nice after just bouncing around from place to place. Get by London. Now I'm even more excited to just get back into my routines and work and you know, I absolutely loved traveling. I'm so grateful I was able to do that. It was amazing. Shall we a go? Let's go. Vamos. Let's go. Let's go. I moved to London. It's my first time in Paris. That was in Tenerife. We're going to Florence. Oh, you speak Italian. <laughs> We're gonna bike to the Pantheon now. <laughs> bon appetit. Salut, chess. Oh my Giovanni. And we always talk about where to travel to, but we rarely talk about why we travel. It was also nice to see that no matter how different people might be, how different these cultures might be, there's surprisingly a lot more similarities than differences. And I learned to practice more empathy. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, I took a quick break to look at this. Traveling's taught me a lot. You can find me <laughs> out there. Literally, I think they touched my brain. Back home now. I have to unpack, which is not fun. We gotta do it anyway. So we have one bag. Two bags. It's okay though, everything will be okay. Oh, my camera's gonna die. I'm ready to go. Let's go and I will see you at dinner.
I really need to cut these. They're quite cheap. I love a good crampon. It's not too short. Oh my god. Oh my I have faith in myself. I'm sweating. Let's get this day started. Post Pilates, post impulsive haircut. I have been preparing myself into another career that is unrelated to my major. After some years of doing YouTube, I was actually interested in marketing. So I have just been taking some online courses and getting my certificates for marketing, digital marketing, data analytics on Coursera. So the plan for today, I'm gonna be taking some classes on Coursera, write the script for tomorrow's filming day, edit this video that I wanna get up, and it's just going to be a very chill day at home. I also wanted to share because there's a lot of online resources that I didn't really know about until I was doing my research. School is very important, but I just feel like that's not enough. And there's still so much to learn. For the past couple of days, I have just been working on my job applications. I have three interviews this week, and this is all for an internship that I will be doing in lieu of school this semester. So that is what I've been doing this past week. I have 30 minutes before my interview. So right before, I'm just going to review some of the talking points that I want to mention. This is a Korean and English interview. I'm about to log on to the zoom link. Not gonna lie. I am slightly nervous, but It's okay. What's the worst case scenario? Okay <laughs> It is the next day. I'm in the same outfit, but new nails I just got a call back from my dream company. I don't know why there's so many interviews, but we did it. We secured round two. More to come. <laughs> Tina said cheers. <laughs> Welcome back. Cheers. Here is a reminder that life does not go as planned. You can always change your plans. You can always change up what you're doing, what you want to do in the future. What is good for you, what suits you right now will always be changing. <laughs>
I have no intention of slowing down. I have no intention of rushing myself either.